All right, now we're going to put in the bottom bar using our spreader tool. And I've got it in place. So, hand tighten to our spreader tool. So it can't go anymore. Then uh, use box wrench. Extend it out. Take a minute. Takes more time than the other tool, but uh, it works all the same. Okay, let's see where we are. Got a little ways to go, and also when we get close, we can kind of a, since it's already curved, we can kind of help it along to get to that point. Hold it and just bend it just a tad. So just probably a couple more turns. I think we get it. I know it's challenging, <laughs> but you gotta have the patience. It's in there. Back this puppy back. Get, uh, get it out. There we go. She comes. She is out. All right. Let's set her back up. Pull these clamps off. And uh, we're going to clip these off. We use this uh, special pliers called a nipper. Uh, I guess you can use different types of uh, regular cutting pliers, but this works best for me. See? Cool. Nice sharp cut, and you notice the sling pulled up just a bit, just to cover the edge, so it's nice and flush. The top, snip those off. Our caps back in. A couple taps. Here we here we are. We got a brand looking new chair, the new swing, 
and it's ready for some lounging. And if you want to have any other questions, please contact us at patioslingkingplus.com and we will assist you in getting the right sling for your chair. Thanks for watching.